Hello my friends, how are you all? I hope you are doing good and I hope you also had a good uh, break. I miss you all, really. Okay, so as you all know, this is our final th or third trimester for this year. Okay, I wish you all the um, success and joy in life. Well, so let's get to work straight away and what I want you to do is to get to page number 23 page number 23 okay this trimester we're gonna go through studying in a different methodology we're gonna implement or apply a different method okay uh, instead of you know explaining things and teaching all on the whiteboard we're gonna do it directly from the book so this is gonna be more clear for all of y'all to see the context and the pictures and the, the explanation properly so here we are i want you to get to as we said page number 23 for the naming level one class five naming different items naming different items so we have different items here as you can see we need to know their names and their spelling also so the very first thing we have here is chair this is a chair guys it's obviously a chair second thing look by the way, most of these things are actually uh, are actually in the classroom. You can find them in the classroom or at the school, okay? So, first item we have here is chair. Second one is desk. That's the desk, okay? This is glue, okay? This is eraser, and it's eraser with S, with S, not Z, because I've heard some people saying eraser. It's not eraser. It's eraser. Okay, and it, we we don't call it rubber because some people call it rubber. No, it's not rubber. You just call it eraser. Okay, and this is paper clips. This is called we call it paper clips. Okay, this is that tool or the item which allows you to collect or gather all the pieces of papers together. So it's called paper clips, and this is obviously pen. This is tape, okay, duct tape, or you can just call it tape, okay. And this is a stapler, you know, the stapler that we staple the papers also together. This is the stapler. This is pencil, pencil, pencil. And this one, marker, marker. We have two types of markers, by the way. We have two kinds of markers. We have something called permanent marker. This doesn't delete, doesn't, doesn't erase, okay? If you write with a permanent marker on the whiteboard, you won't be able to erase it afterwards. And we have the whiteboard marker, which we already use at school. And this is the whiteboard, okay? And this is, we call it corrector, 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 not corrector, no, corrector, okay? Very good, very good. So I want you to read them out loud, okay? Chair, desk, glue, eraser, paper clips, pen, tape, stapler, pencil, marker, whiteboard, and corrector. Now, get to page number 24. It's an exercise or a little, let's call it a little activity, okay? Here it is. So, what I want you to do with this page, okay, is to simply it's about naming different items. So it's simply to name as many items you can find in the pictures, okay? So we have here different pictures. Uh, frankly speaking, I don't know or I'm not pretty sure if you are gonna be able to see the pictures properly or not because I believe the copies or the issues of the booklets you have are in black and white. But anyway, we've got several things here such as bags or backpack we have copy books we have pencils we have scissors we have correctors we have markers we have crayons okay and we also have glue so write all the items or the stationaries you know okay write them here 10 pieces or 10 items write them here it's better if we write them with pencil okay and show me what you did after you are done. When you are done with this page, number 24, you turn the page to page number 25, okay? This is the page number 20, 
five, okay, here. Wait a minute. This is the page number, 25. Okay, so, name as many items you can find inside the classroom, or you can also think of items outside the classroom too. Well, obviously, as we are not in the classroom anymore this year, okay so you need to name 10 items around you in the house okay you look around you in the house and name me 10 items you can see it's better if we pick up things that are actually related to education to your school like copybook pack uh, bag backpack a pencil case eraser pen pencil Write me all the school tools that you use, okay? I need 10 pieces here. When you're done, we're gonna go through a little spelling quiz, okay? This is gonna be for the next session, okay? But I have to make sure that you memorized or you wrote 10 good items here, okay? So, and when we're done, we have to go through 10 pieces, okay 10 items for the spelling okay as for the spelling words okay so we're done for today thank you so much for watching and wait for my next video day after tomorrow as tomorrow is a holiday for the easter okay so happy easter day enjoy guys stay safe take care of yourselves and we shall meet again on tuesday thank you so much bye bye